Well, lately there's been a lot of uh, rumors and talks and shitters and chatters online and on the Twitters about um, DreamWorks doing a live-action Megamind. And, and I think that's a really cool idea, but it's weird because I haven't gotten any, any DMs or any emails from DreamWorks for my part as Megamind. Clearly, I'm, I'm the best role. I mean, I don't know how I could be more suited. I think it's almost a travesty to the movie-seeing community as a whole that I am not the face, the blue face of Megamind. And I, I, don't, I just... It, it baffles a, a human being. I, I don't know what I could do. Well, I think I know what I could do. You can be bluer. The, the level of absurdity of his fuckedness. No bitches. Shalom, Internet. So, recently, there have been some talks and some rumors about DreamWorks doing a live-action Megamind. Megamind, of course, being the greatest superhero movie of our generation. Uh, possibly of all human generations, to be precise. So I've made up some posters and some papers and some flyers and whatnots that we will be handing out today to spread awareness. Hashtag absurdist show for Megamind. Because God damn it, I should be Megamind in the live action version of Megamind. Come on, DreamWorks, get your shit together. So come along in this beautiful journey as I try to get clout through a favorite childhood movie of mine. I, I blew myself for this. Come on, guys. A little like, subscribe, that'd be nice. We're gonna head out into the streets now. It's just a casual day here in Metrocity, met you know what I mean? I don't have money to pay rent. In the name of Jesus. Jesus. La La Palooza, whatever the fuck that is. I think it's an STD. It sounds like one, yeah. It sounds like a Mexican, uh, Mexican soda. I can see that, yeah. La La Palaza. Oh no, it's a famous historic site, La La Palaza. Wow. It's a historic landmark, La La, Bala, Bala, Bala Plaza? It's a, it's a historic landmark, La La Plaza. It's where the, uh, the dude stood in front of the tank or whatever. Cool costume. Hell yeah, man. Enjoy. So, they're uh, talking about doing a live action Megamind. And I want to be the live action Megamind. Can you be badass at it? Movie, right? No, just like an actual movie. Oh, okay. You can be badass. Wanna... Thank you. Let's go. <laughs> I want to be Megamind. Yeah, you haven't seen the movie? Ah. Uh, see? No, they're talking about doing a live action Megamind, and I want to be. Cast me. You're doing it. Exactly. You're doing it, man. Thank you. The bald cap needs it. Exactly. You can't, like, have a full head of hair and do it. I'm an authentic actor, you know? Oh, yeah. I deserve the world. See, even the methamphetamine using community supports me as Megamon. Yeah, Megamind. Megamind. Yeah, animated 2010. Will Ferrell. Brad Pitt. I gotta look that shit up. It's good. They're talking about doing a live action version. I wanna, I wanna be cast in the live action version. That's why I'm out here spreading the word.
the amount of people that have said they're going to watch the movie now because of this, DreamWorks needs to pay me for that alone. So DreamWorks, DMs are open on Twitter, Instagram, at Sets It. Have you ever seen the hit 2010 oh. movie Megamon? I've seen. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah, talk about doing a live action Megamon. I am, this is, I'm trying to get the part. Yeah, okay. I need it. Uh, I hope you I, I can't pay rent, I do need the part of Megamon really bad. I hope you get it. Thank you. All right. That's me when I tie the noose around my neck and hang myself because I can't pay rent because I didn't get the role of Megamind. Hashtag absurd show for Megamind. <laughs> Do they have hats in an extra Mega large? Mind. Yes, sir. Megamind. Yes, sir. Please. The action reboot. And I'm out here just trying to trying to get trying my to name get the in main there. Role. I I just I'm it's been really hard lately. I, I can't pay rent, so I need a job. So I'm really trying to be Mega Mind. Do you have an Instagram? Yeah, there's a hashtag Megamind. on that and stuff too. I'll put you on my Instagram. Like, get you get you some advice. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, uh, I really need a job. We're talking about doing a live action Mega Mind. Absurd show. Uh, absurd show for Mega Mind. Up there for her, and they want to see her ass jiggle, and then they're gonna see my fucking face. You damn well know the picture before is her titties out with her ass bouncing, and the motherfucking masturbator is gonna click next, and it's gonna be this. Get fuck that guy. Man. Yeah, Mega I told you. So. I fucking told you. Talking about doing a live action movie. I'm throwing my hat in the ring. I gotta be. I gotta be the Mega Mind. Got my vote. Hell yeah. Mega Mind, best animated film of 2010. Yeah. Good luck, the Blue Man Crew. It's Mega Mind. <laughs> Bitches don't have appreciation for good culture. Gentlemen, this is how you know a bitch a thought. If she think you are Blue Man Group, when you are clearly Mega Mind from Hit DreamWorks movie Mega Mind, she a dumb hoe. I'm rebooting the Mega Mind movies in live action. Uh -huh. I'm just trying to get my role. I'm trying to get that. Picture. Okay. <laughs> I need money really bad. So, might as well be Mega Mind. Um, There's a hashtag. Oh, Just okay, post some shit. Okay, Tell we'll people go. that I deserve to be Mega Mind. Okay. Okay. Rooting for you. Go get that bro. Bye. Get that Mega Bread. Oh, Mega Mind. Mega Mind from the movie Mega Mind. Mega Mind. Mega Mind from Mega Mind. What the fuck do you think I'm Batman? When the fuck did Batman get blue? I thought I was Batman. Yeah, the guy in the car just pulls up. He's like, "You Batman?" We're like Batman. Mega Mind, yeah, from the movie Mega Mind. See, you knew. Yeah, this guy comes up. Oh, you Batman? Batman. I could have like it's the cape or something, but like. Look at me in the face and you're still like, no, you're Batman. What? And you know what? All things considered, I was having a great time and a great day. But then I kind of stopped for a moment. And I started reflecting on what the fuck was happening with my life. And I realized I'd been out here all afternoon talking to thoughties and people who thought I was the goddamn fucking blue man group and shit. And I realized I'd been here all afternoon and had yet to get my call from DreamWorks. The call had just yet to come in. No emails, no text, nothing. I sat there and I was just reflecting on all of this and what it meant. And then I thought what it truly meant to be mega mind. And I started to just enjoy it even more. Maybe it was that and a little bit of the bump of stuff I got from people, but I just, you know, all the pictures, all the fans, all the clout, it didn't matter anymore. It was suddenly about the art of being Megamind. Bringing the smiles on these happy people faces. It, it meant fucking nothing to me, man. It was about being Megamind. I was truly Megaminding. 
I was living my best, bluest life, and it was great. And it was, uh, so good, I don't, I don't even know what to say. I don't, uh, and I started reflecting on my day. And it had been a truly great day, it had. All the pictures, all the fans, all the bitches that love Megamind. It was pretty good. It was a great time. But without that call from DreamWorks, it was all for nothing. And I guess this is as far as I can go on my Megamind journey. I have to sit here in blue bliss, blue bald actually, as I wait for you at home to tweet and Instagram and Facebooks and all the medias that are social Hashtag absurdist show for Megamind. It's right here on screen. Go ahead and look at that real nice. And just send that everywhere. DreamWorks needs to make the call. Or I walked around Lollapalooza in downtown Chicago in blue face paint all day for nothing. Or a good time in a great YouTube video. Whichever, whichever. But DreamWorks, you know, again, the, the DMs are open. Please slide in. Hey, hey, Beanie. They, they don't understand me. Holy shit, is that what I fucking look like? Jesus fucking Christ. Yeah, no. No, I, I get why they're laughing now. No, that makes sense. <laughs>